a certain job done you know you can do the same thing with certain tools but something we're definitely going to get into uh, uh, before moving forward i want to touch up on lightly on a philosophical topic before we get into the the nitty and greedy details of the youtube and anything yeah. else like a uh, philosophical speaking like i want to talk about like a positive mindset like being positive and how much of a, 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 a thinking the positive direction thinking upwards uh, it helps or hurts your your growth on youtube and i wanted to know what uh, your idea was about that how do you feel about the, the positivity and overall doing youtube well you know uh I, I i tell a lot of people that i see that are thinking about things that don't matter like i just you know when, when you're thinking about negative you think about people that hurt you you're thinking about uh things that happened 10 years ago grudges uh, you know, you're thinking, oh, I'm not motivated to go on tonight. Why should I go on tonight if nobody watches me? Uh, what's the point of continuing? What's the point of putting all this work? Those are things that are going to take you down. Absolutely. Uh, what you got to do is you got to keep doing it. You know, it's like a punching bag. A punching bag, it takes mm -hmm. a lot of punches, but it stands there after, right? So that's what I'm mm -hmm. trying to say. You have to learn how to lose before you could win. My dad told me that. My dad was a soccer coach. That's dad, such a such a good saying. Say that again, please. You gotta learn how to lose before you could win. You have to put up a video and not get a lot of attention. Uh, and we're gonna—I'm sure we're gonna mention that later when we get to the YouTube side about engagement. It's incredibly important uh, mm -hmm. because YouTube uh, like literally thrives on that. Like if they, if they see engagement, they're gonna help you. If they don't see engagement, well, they're gonna hide you. You know, so and it's the unwritten rule about YouTube. And any social media, seriously, on TikTok, Instagram, they're all the same, guys. The algorithm is very, very similar. Um, and now they're pretty much at war with each other to get viewers, right? That's mm -hmm. why Instagram has the reels. They're trying to compete with uh, TikTok. And then you yes. have Snapchat now that's monetizing people to, com to compete with Instagram and TikTok. It's just a huge mess. But it it's just been an explosion of social media. The amount of influencers, the amount of podcast shows, cooking, cooking people, uh, uh, trainers, uh, tarot card readers, uh, you name it. It's like, but, but you know what, Gord, there's a lot of space yeah. for everybody to grow. Okay. So, so if you're true. thinking of making a show tomorrow, I would say, go make that show tomorrow. Go make that show. Let's see what you got. You know what I mean? Like do it, just do exactly. it. Um, you know, a lot of people, what they do is they just take like the, they, they procrastinate, they procrastinate, they procrastinate. And then it turns into jealousy. They just say, you know what? I'm just going to be jealous of that person and not do my own thing. That's very cowardly. You understand? So whatever, exactly. you do, whatever you're putting out, already there, to me, you're a winner if you're putting something out. 